Yo, what's going on, guys? Push my picture back from every video. Another reaction. Oh, this is a music reaction. And a little bit of rant at the end. Oh, put politics. So, this is starting to be my one and only politi political video that I actually do because I need to get some shit off my chest. But I should, let's start off with some comedy and some shit. So, let's do Trump, Trump versus Biden. Up back, battles of three. Well, fuck, dude. <laughs> sure enough, hot. <laughs> it's fucking. I love how they portrayed Trump in this fucking video, dude. They did on Trump so fucking well. If you guys don't know that line, it means like the uh, Iranian military leader that America drone striked in the beginning of the, uh, in January and pretty much started almost almost started World War Three. That was pretty sus. <laughs> the pedophile jokes, you got jokes, Trump. Is that racist? Is that fucking racist? Because, you know, Barack Obama was black and shadows are normally black. Is that racist? It's crossing the border. The pain of losing loved ones is something I have seen. So I know how your mother felt when they killed Jeff for you. Rap lyrics is ain't for you. You should stick a love letter to Kim Jong un You're a rap lady. <laughs> Nothing about you is real. Bitch, you didn't even really write the art of the deal. But you're stacked into the rage, you red mad hatter. But let me tell you, Trump, you're a wise man. Fuck, I don't want to be fun, no poet. Like he has a light on this for you, so he needs a Congress, but okay. She's the kind of person that wants you to fucking get arrested for breathing. So yeah. He wants he the the I'll speak on this later. Trump won that first. The only thing getting fired on my watch is tear gas from law enforcement. I'll keep America great. You unleash a heat fine. Keep America like Portland. Ain't nothing. Guess I'm going to go to Portland. Portland's uh, one of the biggest cities hit by riots and looters. And Antifa is this thing is pretty bad. And it, it's uh, getting pretty bad. You call him Joe Biden gay? I mean, we did. He did say that he was the husband of Joe Biden. So. Oh my God! Jumping on Colin Mobile, camping little bitch. <laughs> nice. I'm sorry about, sorry about that. Uh, my, uh, I kind of unplugged my headset by accident. My bad. Dude, you camp one more time, I'm gonna wake you in your sleep. Could you not? <laughs> uh,. I'm not gonna speak on that because y'all will fucking crucify me if I said something about Breonna Taylor. I think your daddy would finally be proud of you. He was a racist asshole too. <sighs> Biden, just as racist as Trump. Did you know what? 
<laughs> so they're really going to come back with the 2016 Russian influence saying that they had on Trump, which they found fault, by the way. Out of 9.5 million cases. Okay. You think they're stuck like McCain in the Marine Corps. Sometimes I can't tell for which side you're rooting. When we go high, you Oh my god, you oh. fucking bitch. <laughs> what? Uh no, it's a good one. I like that. Oh, you got nothing in the bank that I owe you. You 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 what about balance like a bitch? But the only thing that's ring is Oh my god. You know what people that play college suck and want to do. Trump won this. They had a fucking line about his dead brother's wife is fucked. That was the uh, deal closer for me. Now for my rant. Oh, alright, we going to go little bitch, you little fucking whore. Shut up. <laughs> God, stop camping. I'm so like sick of talking to sister back there. Could you not? <laughs> um, but. I'm tired of hearing people say that Trump did horrible things for America, which, yeah, he did. A couple things he's done wrong. But you can't look at the facts of what he's done right and what he's done good for this country. Now, is he racist? Yeah. Is he a fucked up human being? Yes. But is he a good president? Yes. Most people who voted for fucking Biden are not voting for what Biden wants. They're voting because they hate Trump. That is not how you should vote if you're a voter. You should vote for who you think is a better president, who you think is going to run the country better. Now, do I like Trump? No. Do I like Biden? No. Do I think they're both fucking idiots? Yes. Oh God, you all suck ass. Could you not, dude? Holy fuck. Uh, um, okay. <laughs> Alright, this bitch is going to get his ass whipped. So to deal with. And then this fuck over 10 years, I'm gonna fucking kill myself right there. Oh my god, dude. Yeah, Could you god. shut the fuck up? But uh, people need to give everyone their respect when voting for whoever they voted for. I am tired of seeing people with death threats upon Trump supporters and wish death threats upon Biden supporters. Just fucking be American. You might not like what they had to say, you might not like who they vote for. But you should respect their First Amendment right to fucking vote for who they vote. And you should treat with them as decent human beings. And what's coming was funny is that the second that Biden lost, they call for unify. The left calls for unif unification and come to come together. Well, I've seen so many countless people say death to conservatives and death to white males, death to straight white males. That's not unification. If you guys really, if people actually wanted unification, you would come together and realize that we are, we all need each other right now. It's not, it's not white person versus black versus, it's not Republican versus liberal. It does not matter. Just fucking be American. I mean it. I am sick and tired of this country hating. If I have a Biden supporter in my fan, I don't care. I'll have a good debate with him. I will not count. I will not call him a bad name. I will not say that. I will respect their right to fucking vote. And I will respect their First Amendment. But I will not hate them for voting Biden and voting for whoever they want. And as long as we, everyone does that at least once, at least everyone does that, this country will get rid of hate. Will there always be those racist bastards? Yes, and it's hard to say that, but it is. It's true. There will always be racism in this country. You will not get rid of it. But as long as we stand together and fight with each other, we can make racism a lot less bigger deal. And we will min min minimize it. And that's not just one person's work. That's the whole country's work. And people really need to worry about worry about that instead of
hate to be honest. Anyway, that's, that's done for my uh, rant slash reaction. Trump won the fucking rap battle, by the way. If you guys like the video, please like and subscribe. Keep on trying.